Eric Shaver, Dio, coming to you with another medical information update. I just stumbled across an interview with Dr. Tom Dayspring a couple of days ago. This gentleman is one of the foremost experts on cardiovascular disease and cholesterol management in the country. And he said a couple of things that reminded me of some things that I had said in previous videos. First off, that the overwhelming majority of heart attacks and strokes that occur in the United States are preventable, better than 90% of them. This is something I had mentioned in a previous video, and I firmly believe it's correct. The way to do this, though, is something called primordial prevention, which means to prevent cardiovascular events at that rate, we need to intervene very early. Ideally, we need the initial evaluation to be in an individual's teens and 20s with continued monitoring of cardiovascular risk factors such as blood pressure, lipoprotein levels, and insulin resistance throughout their adulthood. And we intervene with lifestyle interventions first. And if that fails, then we add on medications to make sure that things like ApoB and triglycerides and LDL cholesterol and blood pressure and insulin resistance are at minimum measurable levels. If we do this, we can take the number two cause of death in the United States that's just a shade behind cancer, and we can largely eliminate it. If we're looking to decrease healthcare costs and bring health insurance costs back in line, then this is probably one of the things we really need to be doing. This will require a big culture shift in how we approach medicine in the United States. So it's not going to be easy, but it's something I think needs to happen. Thank you so much, and I'll talk to you next time.